Hello guys and welcome to the first episode, or well, second episode technically, of the Generation game. Um, this is the first time we've it's quite a nice looking hybrid team. Uh, but I think our Premier League boys can do the job. Uh, as you can see there was a change in the rules and that changes that when I upgrade a player that they're, they're permanently upgraded so I can't like downgrade a player because Otherwise, the series will be going on for way too long. So, um, yeah. Uh, here's our first chance. Corner whipped in. And Berahino gets up and wins the header to put us 1-0 up in the 12th minute. Corner's are very overpowered. And we all know that. He can see in the 20th minute. Morgan flicks ball up. Hits the post with a volley. And Berahino again just taps in the rebound. Put us tune up inside 20 minutes against this very good looking uh, Korea League and MS Bronze Hybrid. And that was a lovely finish there by Berahino. As you can see quite late on, we bad pass there and then we win the ball back here with O'Neill. O'Neill puts the ball to Icefield, Icefield into Morgan. Morgan finesses it round the keeper off the post and Berahino again scores his third goal of the game. With a cheeky little open net finish. Moving into the 45th minute here, 3 0 up. And he wins a header, the ball comes back to him. Uh, and he puts the ball through to Palata. Palata absolutely smashed that past my keeper. And that was a, uh, a, a good finish by him to put him 3 1 to me in the game. As he moved in the second half now in the 60th minute, Huang Il Su into Zardes. Zardes sells me with the uh, the scoop turn and makes it um, 3 2, is it? He makes it 3 2 and he goes mental with celebration. It was such a nice guy, I thought I'd show it again. Scoops inside and boom. Moving in, we take a free kick here and it freezes. We get a please wait. I win the game. We get 589 coins. And because we win, we get to upgrade one of our players. If we lose, we don't get to upgrade the player. But as you can see, I'm changing Iceford out. Let's bring in Marcos Lopez from Manchester City. All right, and our next game is against this Portugal team. And this game is why I sometimes absolutely hate playing FIFA. We go Fabio Ferreira. Fabio Ferreira on the ball, puts it into Diego Salaman, and he finishes. Now, this wasn't the goal that got on my nerves. There are a few that do, and you'll see them later on. But this was one, and this was a nice finish from Diego Salam Salamalaz. Nice little play. Works ball out, good finish. This one, Diego Samuels. So I'm getting an absolute lag spike there. Fabio Ferreira, and Pat. This one pissed me off because my my defender goes flipping walkabouts, and it was. If you watch the ball, the ball comes in and watch my defender. He goes walkabout and just leaves him free to score. Then it would be second half, so I held him to you until the second half. And then he plays the ball through. This one, was this one that pissed me off? No, uh, yes it was, because look, his, def his striker was clearly holding back my defence. Stood in front of my defence so he couldn't actually move anywhere. And now, in the laws of the game, is a foul. Uh... There's a hut, there's Rupo. Watch my defender at the bottom of the screen. He gets stuck behind his defender and he scores. And it would piss me off that one. I'm 4 0 down. I think I missed out a goal, but I don't really care. Because the game pissed me off so much. Uh, Berahino there puts the ball over the top to Mecca. Oh, no, no, of course not. Of course he wins the ball. Inside, and now he's going to go down the left hand side. Cut in the middle and sweat it across. And my goalkeeper, I don't know what he's doing. 
That makes him 5 0 to him. And this was right at the end of the game, and this is what this pissed me off the most. He gets a throw in. I win the ball back here from the throw in. Go to Berahino. Berahino to Marcos Lopez. I've gone inside his defender. I'm clearly one going through to be one on one keeper, and the referee blows the whistle. But that is it now, guys. Thanks for watching the first episode, and I'll see you next time. Cheers.